Hey, all you world shakers. This is Uncle Dean coming at you from the Bitterroot Wilderness of Idaho. Um, I got something I want to show you. I've achieved over unity. And this is for certain and sure. Um, what I've got here is a 24 volt system. I got 16.2 or 16.62 volts in batteries. The one battery, which is right here. Let me turn that thing guy down. Off. All right, he's right there. There's a bat. There's our battery. I'm right down there. It's moving too fast, I guess. Okay, just a 12 volt battery now. Now in this 24 volt system, I've got my super capacitor bank, and it's capable. It's holding. Uh, it's got two different runs of 24 volts, so it's got a good capacity for. Hold it. Okay, now what I've got here is my that washing machine pancake motor. It's uh, been rewired by me, puts out high and low voltage. Uh, the lines coming out of there go directly into what two of them go to this transformer in and out and are stepped down. And the third leg because it's three phase that third leg is going directly into that charge control where the other two legs go through the transformer and into the charge control okay hot line coming out of there there's my my tester probe that hot line goes directly into the capacitor bank and then the negative of that goes to the positive on the battery right there the negative goes up to the positive on the battery okay so we got a full loop. And I've got a, uh, I've got amp gauges on the, the motor lead, the ground side, the lead going to the motor. It's a uh, hundred volt treadmill motor, DC motor. It's right here. There's all the specs. We can get it on the video. I can't. I won't try. I'll show you later in another video. But anyway, it's charging this system, a 24-volt system. Now, the motor's only running on 12 volt, right off the battery. Okay, that's 12 volt. But the whole system's charging 24 volts, okay? Let me show you what we got in the battery. For the startup, my lead gun. Yeah, that's what you get for listening to an old man. All right, here's my battery. That's what the motor going to be running off, 12.75. Remember that, because there's going to be more in that battery when I get done. And this is in the whole 24-volt system. Okay, enough talk. Let's, let's see it go. Yeah, I'm going to hook up hot lead. Get her. She's anxious to run. Okay, there she goes. Now, mind you, that motor runs real cool. Very little load on that. Look at this. That's what the motor's running on. 0 0.07 amps. Now, here's what the we're pumping out. If I can get this thing on there. 0 0.01 amps. 0.70 amps. Let's put it that way. Excuse me. It wasn't, wasn't, wasn't 10. It was 70. But she's 68 now. 0 0.67, 68. Here's the battery. All right. This is the whole 24 volt system charge. and climbing. Did you charge control? Showing a good charge. And that's a combination charge control. Well, I'm trying to do it this way. The camera stuff. It's upside down, but you understand. Anyway. 1789, almost 18 volts coming on and coming on quickly. I'll 
hook up to the battery and let you see what's in the battery now. Okay, and we'll come over here, hook up the battery, come back over here, 12.7. So far so good. back over to the 24 volt system, 1850, climbing good, still, let me try the hot light and see if you get any difference on that, oh uh, yeah, one, no, back down to seven, And again, that motor runs real cool. It's real cool to the touch. The reason I put it on the ground because then it rests on the battery. It's, otherwise, you could put it on there. See yeah. here? Cool to the touch. Very, no heat. I mean, it's very little labor for that motor. It'll just run and run and run. There are 19 volts and climbing. Pretty crazy, huh, people? Yeah, all I got is a belt running around the outside of that pancake motor, that BLDC. There's the front side of things. Pretty simple and easy to rig up, really. Still hanging at zero seven. Zero point five one on our amps. Five oh now without touching it. And that's right, the kind of bouncing around here a little bit. Look at that. Almost 20 volts in the system now. Mind you, that's running off a 12 volt charging that, 20, that 24 volt system. I mean, it'll it'll run this thing up as high I want as high as I want to go. It show 30 volts in this system if I really wanted to. Climb. Get you back over and take a look at the battery. Just a minute, we'll get the probe over there. Okay, let's get back over here. There's your battery. Seems like I just seen an eight pop up there. there This is truly over unity, people. I have uh, solved the dilemma. I always knew that these motors had a lot of potential. So do a lot of other people on the internet. And the problem is getting them, because they put out so much voltage, 